How's it going everybody? I'm out here in West Yellowstone and I'm getting kind of thirsty. We've been on a road trip for about 15 hours now and I just want to get some mountain water. So what I'm going to do today is show you how to use my Berkey water filter. This is it right here. What it's rated down to is about 0.02 microns, give or take, I'm not really sure, but it's around there. I just want to show you how to properly use this. A lot of people don't know how to put water in the filter and what it does is it makes your water filter not last as long. So I want to show you guys the proper way. The first thing you guys need to do is unscrew the lid, which I'm going to do. And you don't want to let this filter hit the ground, because that's going to get debris and dirt in that filter, and the shelf life will last not as long. The next step is to take your bottle, and what we're going to do is look at the direction of the water. As you can see, if you look down here, the water is going fast. It's moving to the north. So what I want to do is turn my bottle away from the moving water, because if I turn it upstream, what's going to happen is it's going to push all that debris into my water bottle. Just to show you, I'm going to do it for you guys real quick. See all the debris getting in here? It fills up faster, but as soon as I start pouring this out, you're going to see lots of little black specks. Lots of little things. So what you want to do is take this. You're going to find the top two inches of the water about a foot away from the shore. And then you're going to hold it down on that and slowly let in the water. That upstream water is going to push the other debris out of the way of the bottle. And so you're going to get cleaner water in your filter. The next step is to take your filter, hold it on here, and close it up. And then open it up and you got clean water. So rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later.